Happy 30th anniversary, Metroid. Yay! Welcome back to No Nostalgia Filter. We're going to get sued. Oh, yeah. We are playing a fan game, uh, which I'm sure everyone fucking knows about. Uh, AM2R, the Metroid 2 remake. And now it's no longer allowed to be talked about. Oh, wait, 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 oh. wait, voice acting. Metroids! No, no. Numerous, <laughs> numerous incidents in the past have brought to light the highly destructive power of these life forms spreading far across all known planetary systems. Hoping to secure peace in the galaxy, the Galactic Federation orders the extermination of the Metroid species. I was the best candidate for the job. This is Samus's voice. Samus sounds oddly masculine. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, once, shit! I love the art! I find myself standing alone against the Metroid menace. What horrors await me in the depths of their home world? That looks pretty. I love the art. Yeah, Damn. all pixel art, too. Yeah. It's fantastic. Gorgeous. It's good shit. Holy fuck, this is a fan game? This is a fan game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm telling you, man, this might be my favorite Metroid. This might be better than, um... Uh, Super Metroid? Super Metroid. Crap, Shit. we should have turned V-Sync on, because we're getting some screen screen pairing. Uh, my controller doesn't work. Uh, that's the intro. Oh. Oh, yeah. I didn't realize the music was so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, go into the options. How do I Start. Do there we go. Uh, uh B go, gets you to the menu. Okay, B. Yeah, uh, and press down to go, uh, go to options. No, no, no. Down. There we go. Yeah, uh, we should turn V-Sync on. What is v -Sync? Options. It, it prevents the screen from tearing. Go to, uh, display options, V-Sync enabled. There you all go. Right. That's it. Cool. That's all you needed. A little behind the scenes. Uh, a little magic. behind the scenes. Uh, so welcome to AM2R. Uh, this game is fantastic. Fucking hell, this um, looks gorgeous. Yeah, you, you got most of the... Uh, start out with Morph Ball. Cool. You start out with Morph Ball. If you played Super Metroid, you could wall jump, just like uh, anything else. Um, okay. You. Uh, How do I aim? Uh, the aim is on the wrong button. Uh, then change your controls between episodes. I'm gonna do it right now. Alright, fine. I'm doing it on camera. Hey, guess what? Hot menuing action. In episode number one. It actually, yeah, uh, options. Options. Control options. options. Go down. Uh, joypad settings. Say, this is what you want to see, guys, yeah. right? Diagonally. This is what you want to see. We're gonna put it on this one. Press the button. Press the confirm button first. This is oh, A. Yeah. And then here. Yeah. And Morph Ball, I'm not going to use that way. Morph Ball, I'm going to use with the button. So that's fine. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Good. Done. Good. Okay. So um, so now we're back in. Uh, press the uh, missile button to uh, toggle missiles. You chose to do it uh, Metroid. Oh, uh, that's my fire button. Yeah. Jump button. Oh, you just, that, that's the missile button. Oh, I got to change that because I can't reach the... Fair enough. All right. So change back the back to the menu. hot menu action. <laughs> We uh, probably should have checked this, a little bit more. This might this might be it be like a a point five point five zero point five. <laughs> no, that's fine. People people like this kind of shit. Yeah, people like it. It's fine. Oh shit! I'm done display options. Uh, shit. What am I doing? <laughs> options. Here we go. Controller options. I'm so sorry. We we should have really prepared. <laughs> it's fine. Than this. Everything's um, fine. Players X. Uh, uh, all right. So, so arm weapon. Arm or weapon select. Weapon. No, you want you want arm weapon. Arm weapon? Because you, uh, you decided to make it fusion style, right? Yes. Which means you have to hold it to turn to missiles, so press the button. Oh, this is keyboard. You chose oh. keyboard config. Oh. We should start all over. No, no, Crap. no. Now, now we accidentally fine. press enter. Okay. That's fine. Options. Really? <laughs> controller options. Shh. This is, this is what the people came to see. All right, here we go. Arm weapon. Why would you put them on opposite sides? That's just silly. Um, I will set you to Y. And wait, what? Weapon select is like, do you want normal missiles or super missiles? Okay, that's fine. Yeah. That can stay there. Okay. That way I can hold Y and I can shoot with X. And, and it, it's, I, I actually used the trigger. Oh, you that's know what? How, that's a smart that's idea. That's how it was on the Game Boy Advance. Yeah, we'll put it, uh, we'll put it here. There we there go. There you go. All right, good. Good? Done. That so, was, that so was like a whole episode. <laughs> No, fine. Are you sure? Yeah. Welcome back to Nova Nostalgia Builder, everybody. So now, uh, now we're finally playing the game. <laughs> so yeah, everything that you uh, um, assume is there is there. Um, plain old, you know, firing, plain old uh, jumping, ducking, so on and so forth. Hold right trigger to aim diagonally up. Da -da -da -da. It gives you little things. Oh, and um, just it does this cool Metroid Prime thing. 
where it gives you story. Uh, if you go into the menu and you check the story Yeah, area, I saw that. There's yeah, some lore. But you know what? I think, uh, I think we've been in the menu for a long time. But yeah, okay. We'll check the lore some other time. Uh, so yeah, if you've played a Metroid, you, you know what to do, basically. I, I really do. Oh. Uh, so nominally, I am guiding Snake through this, but Snake is... Like the biggest Metroid fan, I think I know. Yeah. Uh, so in actuality, I'm here to be annoying and make dick jokes while he oh, just blasts through the game. Say, yeah, I'm just gonna play. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm mostly here to, to see the scenery. You know, I've heard so many good things about this game. It's really gorgeous. Holy it shit. is. The sprite work's fantastic. It actually um, it uses Odin Sphere style sprite work. Um, which is to say it uses multiple sprites that move in conjunction with each other. Um, and it just it just does a very good job of uh, of conveying sort of like the idea uh, wow, behind this solitary yeah, uh, alien planet. Uh, the main... Uh, have you played the original Metroid before? The Metroid 2? Uh, yes, I did. Okay. So, uh, yes. Metroid 2 is the last Metroid I played because mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's not very good. <laughs> it really isn't. Um... So, uh, the, the lava, if you remember, recedes yeah, some, some, as you... Yeah, as you, as stuff. I kill Metroids. Yeah. Um, and you're, you see how your Metroid count right there is yep. there's one Metroid in the area. So, I'm gonna go find it. Um, it is... does, it, instead of the way that the old Metroid 2 did it, um, where it just showed you the global Metroid counter, it shows you a local Metroid counter. Oh. So in the immediate area, there is one Metroid. And I know exactly where it is, then. Yep. Uh, as long as this is using the same map that I think it is, I know exactly where that Metroid is. Yeah, they, they, they took a lot directly from Metroid 2, but they also added a lot. There's a missile door. I didn't remember what button a missile door. <laughs> oh, it's, it's only one missile? Yeah, it's only one missile now. They, ah. thought that, they thought that forcing you to fire five missiles into it was kind of dumb. It was very dumb. Yeah. I mean, you know, that's just uh, what you did with the times. You played fucking stupid arbitrary rules and you dealt with them. <laughs> That was just the nature of the, of the... Oh, power grip. Yep. This is the nature of the beast. I really love that they included the power grip. It made it feel like zero mission. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Metroid uh -oh. number one. What? What? <laughs> Evolution. All right. Oh, right. That's it. it. And it's soft underbelly. Yep. Stop it. You generally want to aim diagonally upward for these, and then you can get, like, a bouncing rhythm going. Damn. There we go. I got it. 57 health. I was going to laugh at you if you were going to be the only person ever to die at the first Alpha Metroid. <laughs> no, it's fine. Uh, so the lava receiver. There yep, it goes. right there. That's your lava quake. All right. Uh, do I gain my power-ups? Do I gain power-ups as I defeat things? Is there, like, a power-up hidden somewhere in here? I mean, there's power-ups hidden where they were in Metroid 2. Yeah, I don't remember where all the power up were. Also, there was only five energy tanks in, in Metroid 2. Oh, yeah, there's, like... So there, there's... Was a, there was, like, a bonus sixth one, but, like... There's like 12 in this one. <laughs> okay, good. So yeah, there's plenty of power-ups, and, and you'll be able to see it. The map does a good job of not, you know, using empty space. Uh, once again, you've played Metroid before, so bomb everything. Yeah, hey, I don't have, I don't, I don't have more balls. Yet. Yeah. That's what I'm waiting for, is I'm trying to find them. <laughs> once I find them, I'm going to start blowing everything up. Yeah. I mean, uh, I'm going to do exactly what I said uh, when we played Metroid Fusion. It's just like, when in doubt, bomb stuff. Bomb stuff, yeah, basically. Uh, I could get you probably reliably to 85%. The Shine Spark puzzles in this are nuts. So, oh, Shine Sparking's in here? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Shine Sparking, like, beam oh, combos, all sorts of different cool stuff. Let's find out. I'm, like, super excited to see yeah. what this game has to offer. I, I, abs I absolutely love the graphics. Like, Yeah, they're, like, they're very, like... Uh, Metroid, like, Zero Mission and Metroid, uh, Fusion, but then they still have, like, this Metroid Prime aesthetic. Like, Samus's design is clearly very inspired by the Prime games. Yeah. Um, they, the creator actually said that he wanted this to feel like a 2D Metroid that learned from 3D Metroid. Um, so, like, the cool thing, uh, where it's, like, new logbook information, uh, given, there's, like, weird, so you can actually just roll underneath that. Yeah, I know, but I like climbing over. Um, no, I actually forgot. <laughs> uh, there's so much cool, um, like, lore to discover, and unlike, uh, the original Metroid 2, uh, the, there's actually stuff in the background that, like, speaks 
speaks to that lot. Uh, and we're going to go a little over because we did six minutes of menuing, so... It's you know, all right. Extra, no. extra long intro, it's fine. Yeah, it's, it's just a little bonus intro, a little baby yeah. bonus intro. Um, oh, so wow, these things are neat. Your, your power beam is, you know, shit. <laughs> as, as, as you do. As you do. But the cool thing is you start with 30 missiles, so at the beginning of the game you could just kind of missile everything. Um, I don't know why I waste my missiles. No one that. cares. Well, you have 30 missiles. So, like, you're bound to, to get missiles back. Yeah, but, like, you know, I'd rather save them for Metroid encounters and shit. Yeah, I'm enough. that way. You're, you're a hoarder? A little bit. Samus has a serious hoarding problem. Just in dare her, call Samus a hoarder. In, in a... <laughs> In, in her closet, there's just like tons of missiles. What, like, where do you think out? she leaves all of her old power ups? <laughs> she just shoves them all in the closet. Oh man, what am I going to do with another various? This thing looks, looks like one of my helmets. Yeah, it's, it's a helmet bug. Helmet bug. Um, this is what the Chozo designed their shit after. Ah, lava. Well, remember, this is a Chozo planet. Yeah. So, yeah, there's good. <laughs> just, just <I'm> waiting. <laughs> I wanted to kill it. Alright, let's see what we got. <laughs> this fucking, this, why are you <laughs> running away from me? Stop! I got you just let, like, you're eventually gonna come and get here. <laughs> Alright, that's it's fine. fine. It's fine. It's good. Everything's fine. Here we go. Alrighty, nice. There you let's go. go the good old shot. spike balls. Good old, uh, uh, razor kiwis. <laughs> razor kiwis. Yeah, no, I love them. Razor, razor kiwis. kiwis. They're, they're my favorite food. Yeah. <laughs> It hurt going down though. Okay, so yeah, it it, it telegraphs whenever there's a Metroid. Yeah, just like uh, old Metroid Two. Yeah, the original Metroid Two, which which again is it's just not a good game. I mean, I I'll be honest. Um, I played Metroid Two after I played this. Um, it's just it's it's. It, it, I'll, I'll I'll give you a little bit of background. I have played every Metroid game. Mm -hmm. Except for Federation Force because that could sack the. Yep. Play yeah. pinball. I even played that other one that I don't like to talk about. Um, that other one? The other other one. The other one? Yes. <laughs> the other one. <laughs> All right. Sorry. So welcome to one of the Chozo temples. Yeah, and then that gets a spider ball all over the ceiling later on. Oh, yeah. Another thing about this game is, just like you bomb everywhere, a spider ball everywhere. Yeah, I know, I remember. Uh, like, spider ball tricks are a huge part of the game. Uh, more so even than the original Metroid 2 is the thing. Okay, anyway, as I was saying, like, I played the original, um... I played the original Metroid, uh, 2 a couple years ago. It was the last Metroid, uh, that I played, um, because I knew it wasn't a very good game. Primarily because, like, the limitations of it at the time. And I remember having, like, tried to play it a couple years ago and just being super unimpressed. Mm. A lot of it was the draw distance, too. Like, you had... There was so much that the Game Boy could do. Oh, yeah, and Samus was was rendered way too big. Yeah. Bombas. Samus was rendered, like, way too big, and I understand it was for, like... You know, wait. <laughs> but, yeah, I understand it was for, like, the, the technical limitations. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, all the uh, all the Metroid Fusion bomb tricks are still there. So, char uh, so when you get the charge beam, oh really? You'll be able to like do the vertical oh, uh, charge beam, yeah. spread and the bomb spread and like random stuff like that, which is pretty cool. Basically, if there is ever a trick in any Metroid, it's in here. Yeah, but like Metroid Two, just it just. I remember playing it once when I was way younger, and I played it for like two or three hours, and I was just like, this game sucks. I mean, to be fair, Metroid 1 wasn't all that great. <laughs> oh, no, like, I didn't get into Metroid, like, seriously until, uh, ooh, until, uh, what do you call it, uh, Fusion came out. Mm -hmm. Like, that's when I fell in love with Metroid. Um, I fell in love with Metroid, uh, with Super Metroid, uh, because one of my <gasps> My first friends... E-Tank! Yep, get Yay! your E-Tank! One of my friends had Super Metroid. Same person, actually, that showed me Earthbound and Chrono Trigger ah. had Super Metroid. So uh, anyway, cool dude. Uh, next time on Nostalgia Filter, we reminisce about more more nostalgic stuff and uh, play some more AMQR. Having fun? Yes. Cool. I shoot. I shoot. My shoot. This is my pooper shoot. That's why they name it, because it goes poop.